guys. Good afternoon. Um, I hope you enjoyed reading your story at the playground. Remember, you are to read that story every single day, practicing those sight words. That's exactly what we need to be doing. So today what we're going to do is we're going to do our learning target, solve um, addition word problems and add within within 10. Now, our our target is to learn how to subtract as well, but we're just going to concentrate only on addition today. So we're going to use pictures and we're going to use numbers to solve those uh, word problems or um, addition problems. All right. So what we're going to do is <clears throat> we're going to look over here at those sight words. Remember, Ms. Proctor told you that um, you need to read those every single day so you can get really well at them. Um, let's go ahead and read those sight words. And then we're going to concentrate on the addition portion of the story. Um, so let's practice. We are playground. And there's a photo of playground. Many add, and if you look, there's the plus sign, and we're going to concentrate on that today. Play, how, basketball. There's a photo right here of basketball. All and equals. Equals are those two lines that are uh, one on top of the other, and it shows us what the sum of those two numbers are. All right, so it's your turn. This is super fun. We're going to do the first one together. Um, I want you to just concentrate on the one with the pencils first. And if you notice, there's how many pencils are there? That's right. There are three pencils. So Ms. Proctor is going to draw three here. And then there are two pencils here. And you are going to add those up in your head. And I'll model that for you. Three, four, five. So that means the total is actually five. All right, let me show you that one more time. So I have three pencils, three yellow pencils, two red pencils equals five. So how did Miss Proctor do that again? All right, I'll show you. So I have three, one, two, three. I put the number three in my head and I know you're super smart. You can actually add forward. So what comes after three? Oh yeah, that's right, four. So three four and five. So that means three yellow pencils plus two red pencils equals the number five. Okay. Now it's your turn. You have to go ahead and add the flowers and add the people down here. Okay. So pause the screen and complete those and then you can uh, look, unpause it and then check your answers. All right, so there you go. Um, that is um, the correct answers. One plus two equals three. And then there are five boys who are playing in the playground. Three girls also join in. How many kids are there? And that's right, you should have gotten the um, total eight. Now, some of you, I want to bring your attention over real quick to this uh, particular one where it says one plus two. Some of you see that there are little teeny tiny flowers. Ms. Proctor did not count those. So if you came up with this answer, if you came up with four, let me write that down, four plus two equals six. If you came up with four plus two equals six, then you also got that answer correct. Okay. Um, I just didn't count that one. I probably didn't have my glasses on when I did that, but that is okay. Sometimes adults do make mistakes. All right. You, if you came up with four plus two equals six, then that answer is correct as well. All right. Let's go ahead and click over here. This is for those of you that love math and want to add some more um, using your pictures. Okay. There are, um, you're going to answer the addition problems in the box. All right. These are for you to do. You can pause. And then once you finish adding the uh, pictures together and finding the total or what it equals, then you can find your answers. And there you go. I hope you guys have a great learning day and I will see you next time. Bye.